Today, I'm going to show you the most powerful and secret tool that for those includes to plan your moonshots and your sunshots like this in just seconds. One tip, we're going to use the moment of your reviews. Let's go. Hello, Photopula, Rafael the Bar here. Now, I'm spending a few days in holidays in a really beautiful little town in Spain, in Cordoba. Its name is uh, Inojosa de Luque, it's a very beautiful town where uh, the relatives of my wife live. Uh, actually, I'm spending <laughs> the Easter holidays here with uh, my wife and uh, her uncles. Hi, uncles <laughs> and aunts, uh, Irene, Juan Jose and Mamen. Thank you for showing me your beautiful town. Uncle, think about Inojosa de Luque, this little uh, village in the middle of nowhere here in Cordoba is that this village has a very beautiful, beautiful church, the church of Saint John Baptist. And that church has a cool tower, a pretty tall tower, 30 minutes tower, according to Namen and Juan Jose. And taking the opportunity that I'm here, I want to show you a really powerful tool, a pretty secret tool that Philippines includes, thing the body uses, that will help you plan your moon alignments and your sun alignments. It is super, super fast using the moment of reality views. I'll show you in a second how to do it. With this example here, with this beautiful tower, let me show you the beautiful tower of this church here, the San Baptist Church of Inojosa del Duque. Here you have this beautiful church and its beautiful tower. Look at this. You can see this tower from any place outside the village. And it's a pretty cool element or subject. Plant the sun or the moon align with it. So let me show you how to use photo pills to find when the moon will be aligned with the tower using the Omentorari view, but in a really secret tool. Let me show it in just seconds. The method I'm gonna about to show you uh, allows you to just walk around the scout locations. Imagine that you're walking around in the countryside and you see a beautiful subject and you think, what about a moon aligned with that subject? Will it happen? Then you can use the tool I'm gonna show you now to really plan it in seconds. Let's see how to do it. All we have to do is to go to photo pills, go to the planner. And for this case, I've just placed the black pin on the, the tower of uh, this beautiful church of uh, Saint Jean Baptiste. You can enable the black pin from panel number two and just drag and drop it on the tower, but you don't need really to do this. I have the red pin in some place random and let me switch on the position on the map, my position on the map by tapping the plus button, the arrow here to show where I am. Okay, I am at the red, uh, the blue dot here or to the east or to the west of the church so I can plan an alignment. So to place the red pin where I am, I'm gonna tap on the plus button and the first button on the left, here it is, perfect. Now I have the red pin where I am and I can start planning the shot. The first step is to place the red pin where you are. And next step is to tap on the find button here at the bottom. Tap on find moon at Asimov and elevation or moon on Android. And here set the date range. Look for a moon starting today. Uh, starting today and in two years, for example. Perfect. And now I'm gonna use the AR button at the bottom. So tap on the AR button. Great. Now I can zoom in because my phone allows me to zoom in a little bit more so I can clearly see the tower. And now if I tap on the screen, I'll be placing the move where I want. For example, right there. And to make sure that I'm tapping at the right spot and that what I'm seeing through the meter reality view is, is correct, I'm gonna calibrate the view and see if the real sun, the picture of the sun is right on the real sun. So my view is very well calibrated. So I'm gonna go back. So this position of the moon here is correct. So I just told Philippines I want the moon to be right there. 
So tap on done. And now all you have to do is to tap on the search button because the azimuth and the elevation, the position of the moon is already set through the monitor already. So tap on the search button on the top. And here you have a table with all the possible days the moon will be right where you want it to be. I'm gonna order the table by moon phase. And I had the full moons first. So for example, in October 29th, 2023, I'm gonna have the moon aligned uh, with the church here, tap on the result and check the plan. Perfect. See, the moon is aligned, pretty aligned with the tower. And according to panel number two above the map, the moon height is 33.4 meters. And now in the tower is 30 meters, well, I have a pretty good uh, height of the center of the moon. The moon size in brackets is 7 meters, which is pretty cool. And I can see the, the size of the moon on the map. As you see, it, the moon is going to be pretty big. Here, you want to see the size of the moon on the map, just tap on the layers button, go to the moon layer and switch on show moon size here. That's a little trick. So I'm very happy with this shot. I can adjust a little bit my shooting spot if I, if I want, just to, you know, adjust maybe a bit more south to align the moon with the tower. And I have the shot. I have my plan. I can visualize the plan through the augmented reality view button at the bottom. And here you have it. Pretty cool, huh? The moon rising next to the tower of the Church of San Baptiste here in Inano Inofosa del Duque. A photo plant in a few seconds. So if on October 29th, 2023 at 6.56 p.m. I am at the red pin position, I'll be able to visualize and shoot the photograph the the moon a pretty big moon seven meters moon aligned with the tower of uh this beautiful church here and that's my plan and that's it this is how you can really plan any alignment you imagine when you read the field using this secret augmented reality tool hidden in the fine tool of the planning for appeals all you have to do is to find a nice subject walk and use photo pills to plan the shot and follow the very same steps I've shown you in this video to find when the sun or the moon will be aligned with that amazing subject. That easy. Now, if you wish to learn how to plan your moon shots in a more traditional way, I invite you to watch this video where I show you how to plan your moon shots aligned with the building you know, with another method. And as always, if you like this video, give me a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next Wednesday in another video. And remember, they have the power to imagine, plan, and shoot. Legendary photos. Bye bye from Inojosa. Del Duque. Nice kiss.